This is Mumbai on Demand with Annie. Uh, well, you're not really left hungry anymore because we have food bloggers across the city that are bringing you experimental food to home cooked food to different kinds of ideas and cuisines through their blogs, and which is why it was very important for me to kind of bring them on board here to talk more about food through their eyes. And then, yeah, I think it only makes it all the more delectable. Kalyan Kamagar of Finally Chopped is on the phone line with me. He's talking about the Punjabi food he's been exploring over the week. The National Restaurant at Bandra. What else do you have, Kalyan, to talk about? Well, uh, the National Restaurant reminded me of another place I used to go to a lot in my early days in uh, Mumbai, which is called Crystal, uh-huh. and it's at uh, the Girgaon Chapati. And you will recognize the place by this long queue which forms uh, outside it, <laughs> okay. and it's been a favorite of hostelites, uh, early jobbers, and everyone because of uh, very affordable pricing and sure. uh, good quality food. Uh, unlike national restaurant this is uh, completely vegetarian the south of pics over there are you, you must have the sukha aloo you must have uh, the paneer burji uh-huh. fresh hot uh, chapatis rotis unlike national where you get the tandoori rotis uh-huh. and uh, a big hit there is the kheer which is served uh, chilled from the fridge mm. so uh, this is uh, crystal at uh, girgaon chaat party beside wilson college wow this is killer when you saying kheer is this uh, prepared in ghee Oh uh, no this is this is a milk and rice uh, kheer you know like okay. like the payasam so not not uh, but really made in kheer very very soothing and chilling and uh, <laughs> quite filling as well yeah a must in the summers maybe it just helps to break down the heat they do the amras in summer as well nice crystal we have a lot more that kalyan does apart from the fact that sometimes when he finds time for himself he does write books too traveling belly is his new book if you still haven't uh, caught up with it or bought one then i guess you need to look up his blog and you'll find out more about it and then well you must be a happy person to go get the book i guess kalyan karmakar of finally chopped thank you so much Pleasure. Talk to you next week. Yay.